Hello, Miguel from Grumo here, and in this video I'm going to show you how I've used Glide's OpenAI integration to summarize books. This is very useful if you don't want to read the full book because you're very lazy or you don't have time. So here is the app. In this case I have 379 books and I found this list of books from a website by Derek Sivers. He's already done a great curation work uh, by reading a ton of books and actually providing summaries and a rating for each of the books. Now, Derek Sivers is somebody that I've been looking up to for many years. He sold a company a few years ago. His story is quite interesting because he donated most of the proceeds of the sale of the company, about $20 million to a charity. And he's written a few books that I highly recommend. One of them is called Anything You Want, which we can actually add to the list and summarize using OpenAI. Here we have Glide's user interface, and we have here uh, the data with all the books. They look like an Excel table, basically, the 379 books. And now we are using Glide's new OpenAI integration, the one that comes by default on the business plan, because you can either use your own OpenAI integration and uh, integrate it through settings here under integrations. And if we go here, we'll be able to see that there is an OpenAI integration uh, somewhere. Let me just find it. OpenAI, right there. You would add it and then you would add your um, OpenAI key. But now on the business plans, you can use Glide's existing OpenAI integration, so you don't even have to use yours. So that's what I'm leveraging here for this application. And the way that works, you need to enter a prompt. So we're here and we go to Globals. There are several prompts here to summarize uh, books. It's important to try different prompts to get the best possible results. And there under Actions, there is an action where we summarize a book here. And basically it's this one. It's called Glide uh, AI Generate Text. Uh, there's many uh, different uh, AI uh, prompts or different ways of calling uh, OpenAI. And in this case, I'm using Generate Text. And what I'm uh, adding here to Generate Text is the uh, some instructions. In this case, I want the results to be in markdown format. It's just a way of formatting text so it looks uh, nice. And then the message, which is the prompt, is one of the prompts that I just showed you before. And then the result is saved to another column and that's going to be my summary. But I went beyond that, uh, beyond just providing a summary. One of the things about uh, when you read a book is that many parts of the book are just filler parts or you don't even know exactly which parts of the books apply to your specific situation or in this case, your personality. Uh, and you can ask AI or OpenAI, after it summarizes the book, which parts based on your personality type or any other variable or factor apply to you. And uh, I'm using the 16 personality types that you can get from the Myers-Briggs personality test. And you could find that by taking a, a personality test. And then based on that, on your personality test, I'm asking OpenAI what parts of the book or what real world case scenarios this book is going to help me improve on uh, based on the summary that was provided. But let's start with the summary. So I can go to any book here, let's say Atomic Habits, Atomic Habits by James Clear. Here we have the notes by Derek Savers, which I scraped from his website because he already did the job of providing some really interesting notes. Uh, but let's say I just want OpenAI to summarize the book. I'm gonna click the Summarize Book button and that's going to use Glide's OpenAI integration to summarize the book. As long as the book is before 2021, you'll be able to most likely get a fairly good summary. As you can see here, we got a pretty detailed summary breaking down this book, which I highly recommend, by the way. And there it is. Now, let's say I don't want to read the whole full book. I would read the summary, but then I want to find out uh, some practical applications of this book based on my personality type. So all I have to do is click practical applications and then we'll be able to get some practical applications in a few seconds. And it says here, practical applications by AI. And then um, I'm asking OpenAI to act as if it was a life coach, a professional world-class life coach, and telling me which parts of this book would apply to me. 
And, and he's going to say, as a life coach who has read Atomic Habits by James Clear, I'll be happy to provide you with a list of real-world scenarios where the main lessons from the book can be most helpful for someone with an ISTP personality type. Now, uh, the personality types, you can find them online. You can even ask ChatGPT to provide you the 16 personality types here and, uh, and describe them to you. And this is what I did. And you can take a personality test by just typing, you know, uh, Myers-Briggs personality type or uh, the 16 personality types test. And then you'll find out which personality type you are. And this will help you to find out exactly, you know, how to apply the lessons in this book in real world case scenarios, which I think is very, very useful. So that is pretty much it. I mean, it was very easy to put together this application thanks to uh, Glide's user-friendly interface where you don't have to program anything uh, but I can show you real quickly the behind the scenes which is basically here it's a table with uh, all the books then we have the personality types which I uh, were generated by uh, chat GPT and then all I have to do is and there my user profile I have a drop down where I can select my personality type and because chat GPT already has in its database all the personality types it can't it can do that correlation between the personality type and the summary of the book to provide you personalized recommendations on how to apply the, the lessons from that book, which I think is quite useful, right? And then what does we have? We have different actions. Uh, all the actions are here under Actions tab, uh, but the main ones are, you know, summarizing the book. I also had an action which was summarizing the notes where, that were provided by Derek Sivers and also the applications here, uh, which was taking the, the book itself and uh, listing a series of real-world applications. Now, the actual prompts, and this is where you can play a lot with uh, the prompts, are under globals here. And I think the best one, is, the first one is, you're the best life coach in the world with a keen skill to explain complex concepts in an easy to understand and down to earth way. You've read the book, this is the variable where we're gonna insert the book title and taking the following notes. The notes could be in your own notes and in this case I'm using Derek Sivers notes and your task is to provide a list of real world scenarios where those notes would be most helpful to an individual with a personality type and then I replace that variable with the actual personality type. I'm taking that prompt and I'm adding it to a column here, which is called, um, uh, you know, in this case, the summarized prompt book uh, here. And this is the, the, I'm saying summarize these notes in bullet point format in less than seven words. Here are the notes. If you want to summarize the, the notes or if you want to summarize the actual book, you can use also a template column to do so. Uh, in this case, it's very simple. Summarize the book and then I replace that here. Let me just go here and this is a template type of column. I'm using as a template one of the prompts from the global stable and I'm replacing the variable one with the title of the book. And here we can do the same thing for, for applications. We are grabbing one of the prompts where I'm saying you are, I, I'm telling OpenAI you are the best life coach in the world and uh, you've read this book and I'm replacing that book with the variable, um, in this case there's several variables, the summary, uh, the personality type and the title. And based on that, I can generate a, a complete prompt that I can send to OpenAI using the action, one of these actions, right? So anyways, I thought this was an interesting application of Glide's OpenAI integration in order to summarize books, which is always useful when you are short in time. And if you want to get a copy of this template, just go to grumo.com slash top books. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.